Please be negative. Please be negative. Well, hello everyone. I am doing better than last time you saw me crying on the couch. I've had a few minutes. Hi, Palmer says hi. So I talked to my sister-in-law, Hannah, who sent me a link and it was for free rapid testing. I got on, signed up, both of us have an appointment in half an hour. So previously where you left up, left up, oh my goodness, I can't talk. Is that a sign of the virus? Where you left us was that um, we still have not gotten JD's results and there's a chance we won't get them until like tomorrow afternoon. And I need to start canceling things. Tomorrow Peyton has dance, school, um, her, she, we're taking her and four of her friends to get their nails done. So, uh, we had dinner, dinner plans, dinner with my in-laws, um, people coming over for cake and ice cream. So I need to start canceling all of that. JD's feeling much better today, right? Oh yeah. So his smell's gone, but he's feeling better. So we just feel like we need to know. We're at that point where it's like, um, we, obviously if we have had Corona, we're young, we were healthy, and we probably, knock on wood, will not have lasting effects. We don't wanna give it to other people, not my in-laws, not to some stranger, I don't know, but I still care about it. So, we just need to find out. That is drastically gonna change how we act. We can't send the kids to school. I called the school nurse today and said, do I send the kids or not, what do I do? We're awaiting a result, they have no symptoms. And she said to send them, so my kids went to school today, um, but we just need to get some results. So, Judy, if you were a betting man, do you think you have it? Daddy, oh, I'd be a rich man. Daddy. If I knew, yes, I, I think <laughs> I have it. <laughs> so, Judy thinks he has it. Um, I don't know. I don't know what I think. Um, I mean, I if I have had it, so my ears maybe hurt a little bit, a little bit of um, a sore throat. If Corona was not a thing, I would like. I mean. I feel fine. I would continue fully functioning. I feel like yeah. I could go to the gym. The only reason I haven't gone to the gym the last two days is because I haven't, if, if we have it, I've wanted to be respectful of others. So, I mean, like, I feel fine. JD was pretty sick for three days, right? Really, like, two days of really Two days sick. of really sick. Yesterday, he did Yesterday okay. I was fine. Today, Today did okay. Yeah. So, I mean, that's where we're at. I'm gonna try to, we're trying to make a list of positive things. So I'm grateful this happened before our trip to Vegas. I'm also like, hey, well now we'll have the antibodies for some of the things we wanted to do. Yeah. So that would be good. Um, I'm wondering if they'll let me donate blood because I would love to I give to. like my O negative blood with the antibodies. You're not really supposed to when you're nursing, but I'm wondering if I just like, I need to talk to a nurse and say, how big of a deal is it? Like, cause if it's just gonna maybe not make me feel great, I would totally still do it. So. Turn right. We are almost there, it looks like. Our appointment is in one minute. Yep. And uh, we both have them set up, so hopefully we'll just... We am, I am beat, bad, beat, bad, bad, bad. See, That's he's exactly feeling, what I'm saying. He's feeling better already. Hey, this is where we parked when we had Palmer. Yeah. This is the hospital we had Palmer at. Oh, there we go, COVID-19. Oh, and the jets, look at the jets. The thing I'm thinking about this parking lot. Here. We're here. The thing that I remember about this parking lot is parking and being like, cause we didn't find out her gender, being oh like, what if she's a boy, we don't have a name? Yeah. Like, what if it's a boy, we don't have a name? Well, guess what, we didn't have a boy. It's a good thing Palmer was a girl because she would be named like something weird because we, Literally, we're walking in the hospital. Like, I remember you putting it in park and me being like, Time's up. We don't, even have, we don't have a name. All right, we're here. We're gonna have to kind of probably not record with the giant camera. Pretty sure they're not gonna like that. But here's the setup. They got some of those lamps. We're here. Good thing they put bars on those windows. Just in case. Just in case. Yes. Yep. How many? Two. Okay. How many? The rapid or spit? Uh, rapid. Well, you have a van full of people. Yes, yeah, no, it's, it's just like one. a restaurant. Like, okay, how many? Yeah, we've had 12 before. <gasps> no. Like, yeah. Oh, oh. Going on trips, so. bless you. 
got the rapid, right? That's what you said? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So which is that? Is that That's spit or nose? The, uh, the, the nasal. The nasal. The nasal. If you say nose, the nasal. The, the nasal pharyngeal. The deep one in the nose. Great. And you get the results today. Great. Okay. So, what's your name and birthday? Jamie Ballard. I'm about ready to uh, back out. <laughs> retreat! Retreat! <laughs> Okay, we are only like. Well, I gotta pull over. Oh, we gotta, we gotta pull can't over. Do I don't know why I thought you could do driving. This while I'm okay, we're gonna pull over. We're driving, we're only like legit maybe two miles. Yeah. No, we're maybe miles. five. Are we five miles away? A couple miles. And we got a text saying that our results are in. So JD is pulling over. And we're, I feel like I'm like seeing if it's I. It's like I'm going on a mission. <laughs> Jay's mission call. I was thinking it was like. Okay, everybody, shh, shh. Okay. <laughs> You've hereby been called. <laughs> Hello, JD Mauer. <laughs> Patient portal. Oh, barf. I feel like I, yeah, like I feel like I'm about finding out I had just lost an election. What does it say? Please be negative. Please be negative. Please be negative. 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 It's a great day. We're negative. What? Oh my goodness. I'm so happy. That's unreal. Is that yours or mine? Uh, that's. Oh, I'm Mine. so happy! Really? I am shocked. Okay, How? well, what? I mean, luckily we can double check on mine, right? Yeah. Because you can get also, some of them wrong. I'll get a swab one tomorrow. That's true, right. and he'll get his other results. So at least we'll really know if we're negative. Negative? I, I don't understand that. <laughs> that has to be a false negative. Well, I'm, not I am so shocked right now. I'm thrilled. But yeah, I'm shocked because I can't smell. I can't. Yeah, but you're you have a head cold. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Okay. All right. Great news. That's great news. Okay. Can you, you get my yours. access code? I'm, yeah. It's, no, really. Watch. I'm gonna be positive, and you're gonna be negative. I'm negative too. You're positive. No, I'm not. I'm positively negative that you're negative. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm so oh happy. Oh my gosh, so we're both negative. We saved Peyton's birthday. I feel like we like. We saved Christmas. I don't know. I don't understand this. We saved yes, Christmas. Yes, we're negative. We saved I'm Christmas. So, I'm so thankful. I'm so. Oh All right. Gosh. Okay. Whew. Crisis averted. All right. All right. Yay. We can move on. See, now yes. you have no more excuses. You get your bum out of bed. <laughs> Peyton came home just in time because guess what just got delivered? Look what we just uh, got. Yeah, oh my goodness. Our some friends. Sweet friends. Our friends Melissa and Carter and Dave sent us. Really? Guys. Yes. Were you just in her car? Yeah. <laughs> that yeah. Was really sweet of her. This and they Dave sent us cookies. This day just keeps getting better and better. And guess what? They're all mine, y'all. No, they are. Oh my! Like your bottom. Look at that. Wow. Wow. Melissa, Dave, hey, Carter, thank you. Thank you. How sweet. That's so a really sweet pick me up because it is been a really long morning. It's been crazy. Oh, yum. Okay, yeah. these look so good. No. Away. 
I love you. Are you ready for bed? Should we put a wrap on this great day? Should we put a wrap on this great day? Today was seriously such a great day because it started out such a horrible day. You know what, sometimes it's good we have the bad because that helps us appreciate the good. And the past couple days of having JD so sick really, really have helped me appreciate the good. Like, okay, we can do this. Like, it helped me realize how much he helps. It gave me a new appreciation for all these single parents. I just, like, it blew my mind how much difficult, how much harder it's been. Like, the older two, I can be like, JD, help Peyton with her homework. Although he couldn't do that for the first couple days. You know, and he didn't have to touch her, but like, Palmer and Rocky, I've had to do everything for because they can't do it themselves and it has been a lot. So, so grateful. So grateful to have him feeling better. And I was gonna tell you guys, the second test that he took earlier came back negative as well. So now we have three negative tests from two different locations on two different days. I'm feeling really good about it. I do not, in fact, I'm certain we do not have it. So, yay, holla. Hello. Anyways, tomorrow's Peyton's birthday. I'm gonna go sit out and make a cake and edit a vlog. And it's already eight o'clock and I'm exhausted, but that's okay, that's mom life. Hashtag mom life, huh? He's so cute. So you guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you're subscribed to tomorrow's Peyton's birthday. You do not wanna miss that. It's gonna be a very, very packed day. Nail appointment, soccer game. Treats to school, dance class, treats to dance class. He keeps pulling himself off. Come on, come on back up here, buddy. <laughs> Just a really busy day, but it's gonna be a great day. My baby is nine. Nine years ago today, I was going to bed. Wow, nine years ago today, actually, we were sitting in bed in the basement apartment we rented of this house. I was trying to do work on one of my papers for my masters. I had one more semester left and I, my brain like wasn't working and I, I remember working on it and working on it and finally I emailed my teacher and I was like, something is wrong, I don't know what's wrong, can I please have an extension? Literally the first time in my entire life, my last semester of my masters is when I asked for that. I'm like, I need, I something's wrong. Lo and behold, it was really high blood pressure and I didn't know it. It was giving me a headache, I was foggy, but being my first pregnancy, I had no clue. So I am um, I had preeclampsia. The next morning, go in, I, I wake up and I realize, is that funny? Did you guys hear him laugh? The next morning, I wake up and realize I haven't felt the baby move. I've been so busy with finals, I haven't felt the baby move. So we rush into the doctor and sure enough, they took her and we almost lost Peyton. Literally, like, my life could have been so different. We were so close to losing her. Does that mean it's time to go? Does it mean it's time to go? Anyways, you guys, all right, apparently Rocky needs me to be done talking about this, but so grateful, so, so grateful that we caught it in time and that we have our beautiful nine-year-old girl. So, tomorrow's the big day. Happy birthday, P. We love you. Thanks for watching, guys. See you tomorrow.